In many diseases, like cancer, there is an urgent need for improved therapeutic strategies, overcoming the biological barriers that prevent the drug from reaching its target. Within this scope, a novel generation of carriers, based on nanobiotechnology, constitute promising tools to meet these challenges. Key features of these novel nanocarriers include a size between 100 to 200 nanometers and an engineered surface through coating with a hydrophilic polymer. The hydrophilic polymer surrounding the liposomal surface creates an aqueous shield, making the nanocarrier invisible to the immune system. Targeting ligands coupled to the polymer chains enable a specific interaction between the nanocarrier and the target cell. Like a truck, nanocarriers can be tailored to carry different therapeutic payloads, such as small molecular weight drugs, small interfering RNA, plasmids, or recombinant viruses. The nanocarriers are introduced in the systemic circulation through intravenous administration. The described properties are crucial for a safe journey to the target cells, like a GPS driving system. In the absence of the hydrophilic shield, nanoparticles are detected and rapidly cleared from the blood. The existence of pores in the tumor blood vessels allows nanoparticles to extravasate easily from the bloodstream into the tumor mass. Targeting ligands are selected to bind specifically to receptors on the tumor cells, leading to cell internalization of the nanocarriers. Once inside the tumor cell, the nanoparticle releases the anti-cancer drug. The specific therapeutic effect occurs only against the tumor cells, leading to tumor regression. The described nanotechnology-based strategy provides a safe, specific and efficient therapy for cancer patients. The developed nanocarriers can also be loaded with viral vectors and engineered to interact specifically with other cell populations. In fact, this technology can also be applied to cardiovascular diseases like ischemia. This traumatic event causes inflammation, which is associated with the activation of resting endothelial cells, with consequent overexpression of specific receptors on the cell surface. Like in the cancer situation, this can be explored for targeting purposes. Once carriers reach the ischemic region, they interact specifically with activated endothelial cells. undergo internalization, releasing their content inside the cells. The gene coding for vascular endothelial growth factor is expressed, leading to the development of new blood vessels, allowing the re-establishment of blood circulation. The developed targeted nanocarriers constitute promising tools for gene delivery, namely aiming at gene therapy for cardiovascular diseases. The developed technological platform constitutes a very promising approach for the application of novel therapeutic strategies.